All right. Welcome back, everybody. Um, I was kind of hoping to do this video before this happened, but I'm over a thousand subscribers and over eighty thousand views on my channel. I can't even believe it. Um, so, since uh, my fan, my fan, my plan fell through on what I was planning on doing, because you know life happens, and I'm a grown up and I have to work. So, um, jeez, Louise. Thank you guys for tuning in. I hope you guys are having a great week and having good luck with your gardening and all your projects. I don't have a project going on right now because I'm just too busy working. I'm on break right now and i got to go back to work tonight. But I just wanted to thank everybody and I'm just going to do a giveaway. Um, so some of you guys know I have 3D printers. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have you guys leave comments in this video and then I'm going to wait uh, probably two weeks and then I'm going to go through the comments on this video and I'm going to do a cool giveaway. I'll tell you guys right now, um, I'm going to give away three prizes, and the prizes are going to be, um, you get to go to Thingiverse, pick anything you want on there, and I'll print it out and send it to you, provided it's not like a full-size car or, you know, anything ridiculous. Um, but yeah, oh my goodness, I can't believe it. Um, I'm ecstatic. Um, I was just looking at my stats. I don't normally keep track of that, but lately I've been trying to watch it, monitor it more because I was planning on doing the giveaway before I hit the 1,000, but I hit that and then went past it, so oh well. <laughs> We're still going to do the giveaway. So, uh, it won't be like a first, second, and third prize. You guys can pick whoever the winners are. You can pick whatever you want on Thingiverse. I'll print it out and I'll send it right to you, uh, however long it takes to print this thing that you choose. So, you guys go ahead and leave some comments down at the bottom. Um, oh my gosh, I'm still blown away. I wish I could go out and celebrate right now and have a beer or an adult beverage, but uh, I need to go back to work and can't be doing that until after work. Um, I guess you guys haven't really been out here in a little bit. I did clean this whole area out for new projects. We had some crazy rain and some really cold weather today. Um, we probably won't be able to see the mountains from here. Yeah, the trees and bushes are in the way, but there was snow on top of the mountains uh, just to the west of me here in Maricopa. And I have never, ever, ever seen snow up there, so we got some weird weather. Climate change is afoot. Um, gosh. <laughs> I didn't have much time to even think about this. Uh, I'm still blown away. I can't believe I have over 80,000 views. I've, it's like 80,400 or something. Um, I think a about four days ago I was at 76,000 so somewhere between now and then I got a whole lot of views so you guys are awesome I love every one of you guys I love all your questions I love all your comments even if sometimes I do miss the comments um, I don't always get notifications for all of them because I get so many um, some of my older videos I, I don't know if you guys have seen them but one of my first couple of videos was the high pressure aeroponics system and one of those videos has more than half of all the views on my channel. It's a short little video, it's not very good. I was in my infancy of videotaping and explaining things, therefore I did not explain much at all in the video, but still it was a very popular video. Um, I had thought about revisiting that project again, but I mean, I grew, I grew oh, hundreds of heads of lettuce and I can't eat that much and I don't have the time to sell them. And uh, this is what's become of the towers. They're just out here collecting dirt and dust. Um, and in fact, I, I would give them away to somebody, but I don't know anybody around here that would use them. I mean, they definitely worked. Each one of these has 60 spaces for uh, lettuce. That one's full of dirt and compost, so I'm not going to give that one away because it would be too hard to move it. In fact, it looks like there's something growing out of the top of it right now. That's a that is a weed. Easily easily pulled and dealt with. That's what the inside looks like. Local plumbers were not happy about that because I bought all the 90s they had at the hardware store at the time. I think I bought 100 and 120 uh, one inch or one and a half inch 90s. I think there's one inch maybe. Uh, yeah, I think those are one and a half inch. Wow, look at all the rain we got today. This wheelbarrow is full of water. Um, that's kind of a bummer. <laughs> I'll have to drill some holes in there because it's it's also full of uh, uh, 
gosh. Why can't I think of the name of that? Cocoa Coir. There's a bunch of lettuce growing in here too. Maybe not, uh, not now after this rain, but maybe it'll keep growing. You can feed that to the fish. Eat some of it myself. Uh, sorry about the camera. I don't know. I'm not sure what it's doing. Sometimes, uh, sometimes it thinks it's doing whatever it wants to do, and then I'll go back and watch the video, and it looks just fine. <laughs> um, but I guess we're gonna wrap this up. That's I've done enough blabbing. So if you guys have any questions or comments, pop those in at the bottom. And uh, yeah, as always, keep building. And thank you guys. Be good to each other. We're not here for very long. Got some big fish. <laughs>